Hey everyone, so I wanted to kind of go through all of the stationery that I've collected over the past couple of years and some of it's like totally random, some of it I haven't even opened yet or used because they're just really cute. Um, so this might be a long video, but let's go through. This first one is just sticky notes. I haven't even opened it yet, but I think I got this from the dollar section at Target. Let me move this camera over a little more. There we go. Um, and it's kind of amazing what you can find just in dollar sections or dollar stores. It's pretty, pretty nice. It's cute. So this is actually from a while ago. I went to the BT21 line store. It's not a BT21. It's just a line store, but they have BT21 products in there. And I guess I went, I guess I went around Halloween time because they were giving out these stickers of all the characters dressed up in costumes. God, RJ is so cute. But I didn't use it for Halloween just because I love it so much. You ever get scared of opening up stationery and not wanting to use it at all? Anyway, um, so I also picked up other stickers when I was at the line store. The van got a little bent up. Um, there's that one. These guys together, so cute. They're really big too, like I don't know, I don't have anything to scale really, but like here's a tube of washi tape and I don't know if that helps, but yeah, these are really big stickers. I was gonna put one on the back of my phone, but kind of big. I don't know. We'll see. Um, what else do we have? None of this is organized. It's just stuff I'm randomly randomly pulling out um, to show you. More Halloween stickers. These are a little bit raised, like three-dimensional. You can see that. Um, let's see. These are, here's the rest of it. These are habit trackers for the Happy Planner, uh, the medium-sized ones. So, Hopefully I'll be able to get a lot more use of these in 2020. Just cute little back there. Let's see. Oh, here's more of the BT21 stickers. Like, yeah, look how freaking big these stickers are. So the coil ones are really cute. Adorable. Oh, hello. Doon. <laughs> Photo card from day six. <laughs> randomly hiding in there okay save that yeah they're all just really cute and they're really like well made too i think i paid maybe three bucks for all of these there's a lot there's more in here I just need to find them this one is humongous i think this is supposed to be a laptop or a luggage i'm not really sure and it was cool, at the line store also, they gave these BTS World Tour BT21 Love Yourself Tour stickers. So I have three of them, and I still can't figure out what I want to do. I'll probably stick them on a notebook or something. I did go to that tour. I went to the one in Oakland. Super fun. Because it was Namjoon's birthday also. These are so tiny and cute. Love that. Okay, so... I think these are all washi tape now. Um, I got these from Amazon. I don't really remember the store. I'll see if I can find it. But I think these are all location-based washi tape. So at the time when I ordered these, I was kind of just getting into washi tape and journaling, and I didn't really know what kind of washi tape I should order, so I just ordered some random batch um so they're not exactly the most functional but i don't know whenever i want to journal i guess and i don't, i don't know what else to write and i need bigger tape to take up space this one's actually really cute i haven't even really looked at this one or like write little titles in here or something sorry my nails are so ugly i really need to them up and get them painted. 
This is a smaller one. This one's more, I guess, stamps. I don't know if you can really see that. Yeah, in case you haven't realized, I haven't journaled in a while. I just get anxiety opening up a notebook and staring at a blank page. And I know I shouldn't when it comes to journaling, because I really just should be doing it for myself and making myself happy. But sometimes I watch way too many journaling videos and I'm like, I'm not talented, I'm not skilled, but I just kind of need to get over that. This one's really cute. Yeah, I ordered a lot of these, so when my boyfriend got these in the mail, he was like, what the heck? But, oops, there we go. They're very cute. They're a little bit more, they're not as, uh, how do you say, colored? No, that's not what I'm trying to say. Vibrant, I guess. Pretty transparent. But they're just good for decoration. Anyway, this one is from a Happy Planner line. I have some Happy Planner stuff I'm going to show also. Let's see. Am I holding this upside down? I am. I'm sorry. There we go. This looks like Japan. Yeah, Japan. Script writing on this one. This one's pretty vibrant, actually. The orange really pops on that one. Okay. These ones are smaller. This feathers. And I don't even know what this is. Just some kind of border. Okay. Oh, London. There we go. This one is hard to use sometimes because, let's see, let's pull this out. The, I think that's really pretty. And it's more like more women, but they're vertical. I don't know, we'll see what I can do with it. This one is keys, looks like. Just old fashioned keys. And this is feathers and writing. Okay, what else? This is another happy planner. This is tiny watermelon. Oh. <laughs> okay, so, oh, one more thing, happy planner washi tape. I got this actually at the Happy Planner warehouse sale, which was really fun. I kind of wish I got more stuff, but then I'm looking at all this and I'm like, I don't need more stuff. I just need to start using what I have. So these are the ones that came like in a pack. Okay, let me move this aside and we'll get some Happy Planner stuff. So I was really lucky at the Happy Planner warehouse sale. And I was able to snag one of these like storage cases, which I was really happy about because it's stuffed full right now of stuff. It's not organized at all, sorry. But I picked up one of these washi tape sticker packs. Um, these are all the ones that were in there. I also got stamps, which I've never really used before as a medium in my journal, but I like this because it's a meal planner stamp, which is really cool. Brunch, what's cooking, champagne and wine, grocery list, that could be really helpful. Eat in, take out, it's for dinner maybe. Um, I just need to get a stamp pad for these. I think there's two in here, two? I don't know, I'll, I'll open it later. Um, this one also, I like this one because, I, sorry, 
I liked this one because watching, so like I'm watching a bunch of different things, eating, happy day, like memory type planning. Instead of using stickers, I could just stamp them. So that's really cool. I think this is, this is like a washi tape dispenser. Yeah, so these are the different kinds of tape that are in there, little mini donuts. This is happiness and these really cute coffee mugs. Sorry again for my nails, don't look at them, but it takes a little bit. I've opened up another package of these. Um, it takes a little bit of swiping them on the page to kind of get them to come out really nicely, but I thought that was really cool. Let's see what else I have in here. Yeah, it's cool because like it has like two compartments, so these are all zippers to hold everything. Um, these are mild liners, which I feel like if you're in the journaling planner community, you know what these are. Just like nice pastel colors. I think I found these at Walmart, so you don't really have to order online to find them. What else do we got? Tombow pens. I got these as a gift, actually. I want to try improving my lettering which is hard because I'm left-handed so these always get all over the place um what else do we have let's go through some sticker books that I have I've already used these I'm sure you guys have seen flip throughs of all of these before but this is the wrong wrong Happy Planner Collaboration seasonal book. I really loved this, but I kind of also wish I'd gotten the everyday book also. Let me adjust this more. Sorry, this is a new camera, so I'm trying to, there we go. Can't wait to use these for like New Year. I'm actually not using a planner right now just because, I don't know, I lost inspiration for one. I kind of just was staring at the planner and I'm like, I'm not really feeling that vibe to do it, but hopefully, oh, I didn't even use these. God, these are so cute. Anyway, I'm not going to go through all of it. You guys have seen a bunch of flip throughs. Um, this one's color story. I'm not really sure which, I don't know. I, I know there's different versions of color story, but this is probably one of my favorite sticker books in a while. I just liked the vibe of this book a lot. There's really cute things in here. That one, this I think was one of the first sticker books I ever got from Happy Planner. This is a memory planning one, but at the time I didn't know that there was like different sizes of stickers, so I completely ignored this big. It's for the big size and it's not for classic or mini, which is what I normally plan in. Um, but, you know, they have some stuff to fill up pages. You know what's weird? Oops, sorry. These like half stickers? I never really know what to do with these. You guys, what do you guys use these for? Just let me know. This, I really loved this sticker book. That's why I picked it up, the farmhouse one. I'm not, I need to get a rubber band. It's starting to kind of come apart, but I thought like the colors are just, they're muted, but in a really cute like pastel way. And then I love like, the foiling on that. You guys see that? It's so cute. And the last one I have here is Simply Lovely. I haven't really delved into this book as much. I think I was mostly using these like tiny icons for things. But as you can see, I haven't really used this that much. But I'll probably 
I don't know. Once I figure out what planner and what journal I want to use for 2020, I'll start using this all up. But other than that, I think that's everything. Yeah, actually, no, I lied. <laughs> I forgot I had. Let me pull these out. These are like these sticker pad books, which I really like. I'm glad they came out with these because they're really useful if you're traveling or something, you're not trying to carry around something this big, but you still want stickers to jot down stuff. Come in these little mini sticker books, which are really cute. I like them a lot. This one has more black, gold, and silver, and blue, I guess, theme. This one is brighter, more florals. Kind of just depends on your mood, I guess. Anyway, okay, yeah. That, I think that was everything. But anyway, thank you guys for going through all my stuff with me. I know it's not organized, but anyway. I will probably come back with my 2020 journal slash planner setup really soon. Alright, see you guys later.